You're supposed to be cooking. I was out of milk. Nice try, but not good enough. You're fired. Excuse me. Yeah, boy? Largo Legrand has left Scab Island for good. Well, well. I guess all those laxatives I was slipping into his drinks finally got to him. What? Don't worry, I don't put him in all the drinks. Grog, please. I don't need to see some ID for that. Will you accept a temporary library card? Let me see it. Consultant? You look more like a flooring inspector to me. All right, can I get you that drink now? Yeah, I could really use it. Name your poison. What do you got? Well, we have some specialty drinks here at the Bloody Lip, like Yellowbeard's Baby, Bloody Stump, and Blue Whale. I'll have Yellowbeard's Baby. Well, you can try, but I don't think nature's on your side. <laughs> Just give me the drink, please. Hey, I have to crack jokes. It's a union thing. That'll be one piece of eight. Okay. Here you go. And here's a complimentary crazy straw. We give them to all new customers of the bloody lip. Bartender, give me a drink. Name your poison. Mix me up a blue whale. Sorry, blender's not big enough. <laughs> oh, but seriously, that'll be one piece of eight. Okay. There she blows. Nice place you have here. Well, see ya. It's a green drink and a broken glass. Where do you want to go? Cruises! Check it out! Glass bottom boat. Come on! It's all paid for by Booty Island Parks and Rec. <clears throat> Captain Loogie is in the house. Let's go! Spit! Come on! Hey, he's been working out! Looks like second place. I think that deserves a little applause. Now, how about the rest of you? No volunteers! If Blackbeard were here, he'd shoot you all right now! Don't let this grass wither up and die. Boy, this stuff makes my spit thick. No volunteers. If Blackbeard were here, he'd shoot you all right now. What was that? Did I hear somebody swallow? What a waste. <clears throat> Captain Loogie is in the house. Spit away. Let her rip! Woo! You can do it! <laughs> Better not blow it, man! He's cleared first place! That was truly awe-inspiring!
Sports fans, we've seen something incredible here today. Let me congratulate you and give you this fine commemorative plaque. I salute you, Captain Loogie. Come on, let's give him a hand. Of course, there are plenty more prizes for the rest of you. So how about it, gang? Two, four, six, eight. Come on, let's expectorate. It's a plaque with an odd-looking gob of something on it. Everybody already has the necessary equipment. Valuable prizes. Just look at this juicy crowd. Cruises. Check it out. See the world. It's a plaque with an odd-looking gob of something on it. I have to go now. How much will you give me for this plaque? I'm not interested. What do you mean? It's worth a mint. For a lump of pus on a shingle? That's not just any lump of pus. Oh yeah? What's so special about it? The spit of the person who killed LeChuck is on it. Really? That would make it very valuable. And I do like bronze anyway. I'll give you 6,000 pieces of eight for it. Check it out. Sightseeing. I'm interested in chartering a ship. Great. As I mentioned, my fee is 6,000 pieces of eight. Okay, I'll pay you the 6,000 pieces of eight. You've chartered yourself a ship. Are you ready to leave now? Uh, no, I need to take care of a few things first. Let me know when you're ready to head out. I'll be here. Glass bottom boat. Cruises. Where do you want to go? The Joy of Hex. I think it's meant for advanced voodoo practitioners. The writing's way too technical for me. Hear the sound of my feet talking. Hmm, I'll have to remember that.
I've had it with this card catalog. Great shipwrecks of our century. Hmm, I'll have to remember that. Uh, pardon me, miss. What do you want this time? I'm looking for a book. What book are you looking for? Do you have great shipwrecks of our century? Okay, here you go. Anything else? I won't be needing any more books just now. Remember, silence is golden. Great shipwrecks of our century. It says here the Mad Monkey sank at 36 North, 90 West. Where do you want to go? Three hour tours. Are you the same Kate who bought all the near grog at the Bloody Lip? Yeah, and you can't have any of it, so don't ask. I'm ready to set sail. Have you got a course planned or anything? I can show you where I want to go on this map that Captain Dredd gave me. Well, here we are. What now? Let's head back to Booty Island. Okay. I have a treasure guarantee policy with all my charters. Since you came back empty-handed, we can go out again, free of charge. Just let me know if you want to go. Cruises! Great shipwrecks of our century. It says here the Mad Monkey sank at 36 North, 90 West. Sunken galleons! I'm ready to head out again. Okay, show me where you want to go this time. Well, here we are. What now? I'll dive in and look for the sunken galleon. Are you sure you can swim? Hey, I can hold my breath for ten minutes.
It looks really heavy. This monkey head is too heavy to carry to the surface. Considering this game has no drop verb, I'm doomed. This monkey head is too heavy to carry to the surface. Considering this game has no drop verb, I'm doomed. It's too heavy to swim with. This monkey head is too heavy to carry to the surface. Considering this game has no drop verb, I'm doomed. Looks like Kate's anchor. Looks like Kate's anchor. I got the monkey head! Well, let's head back to Booty Island. Well, congratulations on your find, Guybrush. Be sure and tell any friends you might have about capsized charters. See you around the turnpike. Glass bottom boat. Well, well, I didn't think anyone would ever get the Mad Monkey's figurehead. Can I get the map piece now? <laughs> sure, it's yours. Yeah, now I got two map sections. Where'd you want to go? Once again... Ah, LeChuck, sir. I just wanted to report that we have finished building the new torture chamber you requested. Very good. Do you have anything else to report? Ah, uh, no. Well... There is one other small little thing. I assume this has to do with Guybrush's capture? Well, sort of. You've allowed him to find the second map piece, haven't you? You fool! You ought to ready your ship and sail after him yourself. Find him, or die.
What do you want, kid? I'm selling these fine leather jackets. Sorry to bother you. You again? Open up! This is a raid! Get lost! No more bets? Okay, here we go. Four black. All right! You win again. Today is your lucky day, all right. Would you like money again? Yeah. All you have to do is watch the wheel go round. Give me the next number. First, give me the password. If this is five, what's this? Four. Right. The winning number will be 12 red. Thanks. What do you want, kid? What's the next winning number going to be? First, give me the password. You have to get it right three times. If this is four, what's this? One? Okay, that's one right. Two more. If this is one, what's this? Two? That's two. One more. If this is two, what's this? Four? Okay, you must be a member of the Gamblers Club, but I don't recognize you. What? You don't remember me? No, but that's okay. You wouldn't have gotten the password right if you weren't a member. The winning number will be three red. No more bets? Okay, here we go. Twelve red. All right! You win again. Today is your lucky day, all right? Would you like money again? Yeah. I think that's enough for me today. Okay, Ralphie. See you tomorrow. Place your bets, please. I'd like to place another bet. Here's one piece of eight. Okay, kid. Which number you want? I'd like three red. Okay, here we go. Three red. You're a winner, kid. Which of our fabulous prizes do you want? Take your pick. You can have 60 pieces of eight, 
Or you can have the invitation to Governor Marley's Mardi Gras party. Or you can have a free pass to see the Linguini Brothers Circus. Well, which will it be? I'd love to have the invitation. He wants the invitation. Congratulations. Thanks. Big prizes for just one piece of eight. You are cordially invited to Governor Marley's Mardi Gras blowout. Don't forget to bring this invitation when you pick up your complimentary costume. Please present invitation at door and wear your costume. Where do you want to go? Ah, you have a costume on reserve. Well, that's a different story. Let's see. Your costume is right over here. Walk this way, please. Well, here it is. You'll surely be the talk of the party in this. Well, have fun and enjoy your costume. I don't want to wear this right now. This is really nice. Excuse me. Hope you're enjoying your costume. Excuse me. Hope you're enjoying your costume. Sightseeing. Check it out. Sunken galleons. Sightseeing. Sightseeing. Three-hour tours. This may be your last chance at popularity and success. Just look at this juicy crowd. Sunken galleons. Last day before I leave for Fat Island. Sightseeing. Cruises. Sunken galleons. Get a grip! Don't you know a Mardi Gras costume when you see one? Is there something I can help you with? I'm here for the governor's party. You mean Governor Marley's Mardi Gras fish fry? It's invitation only and costumes are required. Now I've got my invitation right here. Well, what do you know? You do have an invitation. Do you have a costume? I have my costume right here. Better put it on. Well, if you insist, but you'll have to try to restrain yourself. No, no, not here. Go in the bushes or something. Jeez. Oh, that is nice. And the boots are a nice touch. Okay, I guess you can go through. Have fun. Nice! 
Leave me alone. I'm busy. Leave me alone. I'm busy. Oh, what a cute little thing. You'd better not touch that dog. It's empty. They're empty. It's a beat up metal trash can. Hey! What is all the racket? Don't mess with the governor's cans! Huh. Kitchen staff only. Sorry. The sad kitchen staff only. Sorry. You again? Who do you think you are? You better just get out of here! No good punk! Hey! Come back here! I'm not done yet! If it's not raccoons, it's teenage vandals! You are. Anyway, like I was saying, you heard me. Get lost, punk. I'm gonna sweat off 20 pounds in this stupid costume. Nice costume. No kidding. I forgot to put air holes in mine. Well, looks like I'm too late for the hors d'oeuvres. To Elaine Marley! Nice costume. Thanks. More subtle than most. Yeah, thanks. Not your usual larger than life. It looks like part of the map to Big Whoop. Nope. Probably saved a lot of materials, huh? <laughs> I'm sure I don't know. Not that paper mache is very expensive. Do you mean papier marché? Yeah, whatever. No, I don't imagine that it's very expensive at all. Still, you must have saved the bundle, kid. <laughs> I never scrimp when it comes to the holidays. Well, I, I didn't mean you were cheap. That makes three map pieces, only one to go. Well, what's the matter, boy? Smell something? Uh, nice doggy. <laughs> What's the matter there, Gabrush? What? How did you know my name? I was talking to the dog. 
Who are you? She named her dog Guybrush? Yeah, I don't get it either. It's not much of a name if you ask me. It says it's because he's dumb and helpless and keeps getting in the way. He sure can sniff out the governor's possessions. Maybe you should empty your pockets. Try and catch me, old man. Oh, uh, look out for that rake. Governor, I caught one of your party guests making off with your grandfather's map. Another would-be treasure hunter, eh? Bring him in. In here, Guybrush. Guybrush? Guybrush Threepwood? The one and only Sugar Bear. Of all the parties in all the houses on all the islands of the Caribbean, he had to crash mine. It's destiny, Honeycakes. Don't talk to me. Snugglepuss. Get lost. Punky Doodle. I'm warning you. Pooper Dooper. Maybe I should go rake the back 40. Look at us, together again. Boy, we haven't been like this since, well... Since I quit my job and moved away without leaving a forwarding address? Was that what happened? Gee, I, th I thought... Guybrush, can't you take a hint? We were a mistake. I thought we had an agreement. Look, Chuck's alive, and I need your help to fight him. Same old Guybrush. Is that a new blouse? Can't you take a hint? Can't you see how my heart has suffered? Oh, really? Elaine, take me back. I can't live without you. You're getting warmer. I realize now what a fool I've been. Oh, Guybrush, I know I shouldn't have anything to do with you, but there's something about your weakness and ineptitude that I find infectious. Does that mean you're going to let me have the map? The map. Is that what this is all about? I should have known better. If the map's all you care about... You'd better go out and get it. So, where are all the chicks? Yeah, I thought there'd be some here. She's gone. I guess I really made her mad this time. Man, she has shoulder pads and everything. I think I'm wearing enough women's clothes right now. Nothing back here. I'd like to, but I'd better stay in costume. Hey, it's Kyle Katarn in a dress. Comfy. I better not muss up Elaine's sheets. Central Caribbean School for Governors, Crew 67. Well, maybe she won't miss this old thing. It's impolite to stare at a woman's chest. It's just a porcelain replica of a chest. I hate that knick-knacky junk. You know, I heard some guys talking about Marley's bust. This must be it. I don't want to break anything. Elaine would kill me. And again, in these costumes, <laughs> who can tell? That's true. Ha! <laughs> 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 Work as loud as you want. Hilbert's out raking the back 40.
Well, shoot. Oh, what a cute little thing. I'd like to, but this dress just doesn't have the pockets for it. I'm gonna ditch this thing once and for all. Okay, dog. You're coming with me. Where do you want to go? Caught anything yet? Oh, hi. Giving any more thoughts of that little wager? All right. It's a bet. Great. I am really looking forward to making you eat my catch. What with all the sewage from Governor Fat's mansion, the fish are usually pretty gross. I never eat mine. Just sell them to restaurants. Best get fishing, buddy. <laughs> Oh, what a cute little thing. Sure is big. Um, think I'll drop a line right here. Plunk? Wow, I've got a nibble already. Holy cow, he's a monster! I've got him! <laughs> what a battle! Wow! This is the biggest... The, uh, well, it, it's almost as big as the Leviathan I just hauled in. Really? Where is this Leviathan? Uh, uh, I think you're lying. Yeah, you're right. It was just a fish story. I guess you win. Here, take the pole. Where do you want to go? It is a nice pull. Dang. <laughs> 